Hello and welcome everyone. We're doing a video today. We've decided we're changing our minds about the solo adventures because we looked at some of the cards. A bit of calculation. 700 gold gets you 7 packs. Uh, probably 5 of them will be 40 dust, which is about 200 dust. Probably get an epic in one and 2 res in another. So that's an extra... Um, 95 and epic over, and then um, extra res and extra 25. So, if you're talking about 200, you're talking about 400 dust worth, but by doing the actual, um, but by doing actually one of these chapters, you get some guaranteed cards which are you know. We have a look at this one for example. Prize is that's worth 40 dust, that's worth 40 dust, and this is obviously you've got um what's it called? You've got a legendary weapon, so I think that's definitely worth it. And even if you decide to go the other route with the League of Explorers, we're talking about an epic card here, a rare Yes, yeah, so I think it's definitely worth it. In a way, it's even better than the regular price. I'm not sure about the later ones. Yeah, we need Guardian. Wow. Okay. So I think I'm going to go with... Pure Power. Um, it seems so interesting, this weapon. So that's really tempting. On the other hand, what do we have here? Twin spell, which is actually a really useful card in the beast deck. A quest card. <coughs> Control the quest, add the coin to your hand. Let's, uh, let's see if that's. Quest decks tend to be packed out, so to add something which just gives you a coin, I'm not so sure how good that is. Mm, the coin's still good. Draw a card for each card you've played this turn. That's incredible value. I just wonder if I could put that into a test grain in deck, maybe. Just draw loads of cards after drawing lots of one as I was playing lots of one cards. Oh, this is a very interesting one. Some the one cost me for a deck. So you can cheat out some big minions if you um for example if you have your academic espionage or you have Luna's Pocket Galaxy, so you can actually have some crazy OTKs, you know, where with the cheating out uh, one mana at Antonidas and things like that. We played the Elemental last turn, someone's copied this. That's a really powerful card to get Elemental Mage, which I don't think even exists at the moment. And you've got Taunt Reborn, can't be targeted by it, spells of hero powers. That is incredibly strong because that is that's like um, <clears throat> we just think about how annoying it is to remove um, that ten ten which has reborn and divine shield. Yeah, <clears throat> this you can't you have to do with minions. So you basically have to have eight attack plus one attack to get rid of both versions of it, including the reborn one, and that's not easy. So that can be really, really devastating, that. And of course it's a beast, so you can give it 16 health instead of 8 if you use a special um, druid card. Dark Prophecy, discover a 2 cost minion. Okay. Summon it and give it 3 health. So I guess if it's got a death rattle or it's a taunt, that could be pretty good. Um, if it's got Battle Cry, then that should be pretty bad because Battle Cry is usually understated. And it says um, summon, and it doesn't say play it, which means you won't unlock the Battle Cry. Um, I think we're going to go with the League of Evil version. I'm really fascinated by this. The Fist of Raden. Here we go. Uh, Request unlock a chapter one leave of explorers. Oh, well, we don't have a choice anyway. So there you go. So we have to get this one. All right. Okay. Unlock chapter one with gold. 
instant reward. And there we go. Fresh scent. Shadow Sculptor, so we get two of each. Okay. Evil is patrolling the coast from the air. Right, okay, so let's have a look at this. How fast can you get there? This is Dr. Boom. Can we counter attack? So I guess in chapter one evil um hmm. Hmm. I'm not sure why it's a counter attack. It's over, Boom. Uh, Put your hands up and throw them. Okay. Uh, uh, keep this because you get a decent one drop. Let's see what I hear about this first. Okay. Ooh, interesting. After you play a spell game, one sp spell damage. Huh, you have any. I do one list in a minute and the minion to the right of it. I could have attacked with them, we knew last time. I guess we do this. <laughs> right. Got him! Hey, Kritiki! Fly the prisoner to the violent home! <laughs> Two, three, four, five. Okay. What's that do? Add a random boom lab's mech to your hand. Bad news! Uh, uh, let me concentrate! Okay, so we've wasted the card. Alright, it draws a card here. Right, so the idea here. Um. I think it's going to rush us to the two actually. We're feeling the bud. Um, so, crackling raisin what? <coughs> what do you do? Rush to the spell. Okay, let's see what I get from this first. Got Wind Fury, you know what's coming next. Oh yes, that's what we like. Yeah, this is I just you can get out of this all here. Oh we can actually if he kills this with a cobalt lucky and he gets lucky hits me there. Okay, so that's that's enough to take him down to the movie so What's this do again? Let's have a look. Let's see. Yeah, that's exactly what I was saying. If you manage to kill off his bomb, you kill off my big minion. Okay. What do we get as a reward for this? Is this a twin spell prize we get here? And it's... Skydiving Instructor. Okay. Next one. They've unleashed an elemental against us. Help. Create a copy of me and silence it. Mm, not another silence one. Okay, that's better for getting missing elemental on the loose. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, so what do we have in that then? That was quite a slowish deck there. Yes, I think. Uh, Did benefit from spell damage. What have you here? Come and go, 
Oh, that's interesting. Vargas is interesting as well. Pintama. Hmm. That's what the point of this is everywhere. Disagree there, it copies your spells. Oh, we're actually playing as properly Gadgar here. Oh, we've got him. That's nice. Thank you very much. Okay, that's interesting. This thing would be refreshing on a hot day. I stole them. I'll go play this. Copies my spells. Right. So, so we have triple spells here. Yeah? We're really getting overloaded here, aren't we? Um, we nine. We don't have three wings. Okay. Oh, let's do this. Okay, so this turns into two dimensions. Minion. Okay. Right, um, I think we kill one off. I think it's a bit of over overkill here, having so much value. Um, add two random mage spells to your hand. Okay. <coughs> this is actually quite interesting. It's actually uh, looks quite challenging. If five mana just does this turn only. Well, that's interesting. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Uh, mind. Um, if I can, almost works. So now I've got ten mana. That's interesting. Okay. Um. Good to discount a spell. That's pretty good. Oh, it cost violence portal. Five is always good. I see you can copy the uh, opponent's one as well, right, okay. Got it? Okay. So does this work? Yeah, okay. Oh no, I could have got two minions. 
moment. I am just go all face. I think we can go all face there. That's interesting. Castera. Zero Cross Blizzard, which means I can effectively do board clear. More or less. Uh, we could try starting off the Antonidas. Do we have lethal here potentially? I got enough to win from what I've got in my hands here already. Let me cast that again. I'm a random target. Oh. That's not going to help, I'm afraid. Um. My strength is yours. Ooh, so this could be really useful now. Oh, the blizzard does six damage across the board. I think we've got lethal here though. Got 28 damage in. That's pretty easy. This is one something which generates some lots of value. What did he actually have? A lot of freeze sort of stuff, nothing too scary. Okay, I'm trying to work out what to do when I get onto onto heroic mode because you have to craft your own deck for that. And we have a an animated avalanche. Okay, now I guess we're going to play a shaman here of some sort. Let's bring that bird down. Give a minion reborn and can't be targeted by his spells of hero powers. Wow. And this flies off against a flying foe without any wings of her own. Krizuki. <laughs> oh, I recognise these. We had them in the, in the tavern brawl. Yeah. That's why these are slightly familiar. Even though I've never played this one before. Ooh, looks like we've got a dragon druid. <clears throat> That's good, these two are good. Um, I don't think the claws that useful. Uh, okay, that's not too bad. Um, I guess the heal one, look at the top three cards of your deck. Choose one to draw. Hmm. So it's basically draw a card, but you can choose which one you want. That's a very interesting thing about it. Fighting us from the air. Huh. Hmm. Um. Let's just do this. Okay. 
So what's the quest? Um, spend mana on minions. Okay. So we'll do this. Ooh. Of course, she has to die straight away, isn't it? Um. Right. Just put some stats on the board. Oh dear. That one one could be very important here. Mm -hmm. Do I play this now? Draw a card. I think I try getting value. Uh, let's play this first. Next turn, we're going to try getting the value from this. That's nicely on cover. Oh no! <laughs> I don't make too much difference that. Okay, let's try this now. Ooh. Interesting. So we get to we get a lot of garden moves. Oh, we've got a spell fine. We can play this once there uh, because uh, it's going to get discounted because of that. So we get from there. That's interesting. Got ten cards in hand here. Okay, we go. So we look at eleven damage. Maybe they make it easy you know, so that people can get their um, their prizes or their awards easier. I don't know. It would be much more fun. Alright, let's finish up here. It's probably useful as it is, but. Oh wow! Aha, I've got a perfect idea for this situation. Uh -huh. There we go. That's pretty straightforward. Okay, and now we get the big. It's hinting to us this goes in the big dragon druid priest um beast deck. We've got two of them now, nice. This is a priest card. Uh, this is interesting. I wonder if you could put this in. Combo priest. Discover two plus minions, some that give it to me health. I mean let's say we get a one four, that become a one seven for three mana. I guess you get lethal next turn, turn 
ten four for the coin. A couple of thousands twice, it makes it twenty eight. We made it ashore, barely. Mm. We need some allies and wings. Okay. Right, and unlock chapter two for both League of Spurs and League of Oh very good. So it wasn't okay, they haven't gone over the top. So basically yeah. So it's only seven hundred gold per chapter. Alright, fine. So maybe we will go on with it. Um so what are the prizes for this one? That's oh that's that new um demon card. Do you see in battlegrounds? If you hold your dragon discover a spell from your deck. A copy or an actual spell? That's interesting. Mm, mm, fascinating. We start to draw a card. That's a bit strange. Transforming it into a random one that costs three more. Well, that sounds interesting. Alright, thanks for watching everyone. Um, I'm going to try it on Heroic mode at some point. Let's just have a look at the new cards. Get the new cards for so two winged guardians, two fresh scents. Do we actually have a beast? No, we don't at the moment. We could definitely go into our uh, highland hunter. Maybe, maybe it's the possibility of having a beast deck, mm. a mental deck. Um, Attention to our combo deck. I mean, what would I prefer? Would I prefer to have extra arms giving me 2 2? Would I rather have an extra 2 2 or a fresh minion on the board with a lot of health? And when it gets reborn, that's the other question. Does it get reborn with the extra health? I'm guessing not. Alright, it's interesting. Maybe we'll put it into our, our deck. We'll see. This looks really good, especially um, especially if you've got Galakrom. Maybe we can play Galakrom Test Greymane. I'm just wondering, with all the card draw that the Galakrom Rogue has. Huh. Okay, I have to think about that one. And we've got ooh, Golden Hungry Crab. The Golden Dark... Dozing Marksman. Alright, these are the ones which we just got from Fleeting Quest. South Sea Captain. Oh, I'm sure that's still there. A Twin Tyrant. Okay. Alright, so. Um, okay, so. Hungry, hungry Dozing Twin. Right, okay, so that's only my second uh, Hungry Crab. So, if we get another Hungry Crab, that's going to be. It's a nice 400 gold there. That's what I've got for this uh, week's, um, this month's prize for finishing uh, rank 5 or above. Where's this dozing one? There you go, we can disenchant that. That's 4 damage while attacked. Oh, so this can actually go into one of those, what's it called, decks? The, um, the warrior decks. You end up with... Um, 4 3 to start off with. Self damage with that weapon which damages itself. And Twin Tire, I'm pretty sure I've got at least two Twin Tires already. Yeah. So just enjoy the graphics. Not very exciting, but there you go. That's it. Okay, thanks for watching everyone, and uh, we'll see if we could make some new decks or something like that. Um, hmm. Okay, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.